As you can tell by the title of this video, it is not going to be a good review. And I'm basically warning all of you girls and guys, if you use self-tanners out there, that you should not, not, not use this tanner because it will look terrible. And so many people have not liked this tanner. I wish I had looked up the reviews on it before I had put it on my skin and messed it up. And now I look like an orange carrot. You probably can't tell on camera, but it's mostly my arms. Um, I don't know if you can tell, but it is really orange. It's coming up a bit pale on screen, but in real life, it's like, it's like close to almost this color. And it's just gross. Okay, so this product is called um, Sublime Bronze Tinted Self-Tanning Lotion. And um, it gives you an instant bronze glow. And it's by L'Oreal Paris. And mine is in the shade Medium. I don't know if that stands for Medium Skin Tones because I already have a... Um, pretty dark complexion. I My lowest shade is usually an NC35 in MAC, so I just like to build a nice bronzy tan, not so much orange like how this turned out, but I like to build it up bronzy. So this thing says it will not streak, um, it will give you a perfect tan, and um, it won't rub off or stain on your clothes. Okay, definitely it does not rub off. Um, especially if you make a boo-boo. Like, it will not rub off. Um, I was very careful when I was applying this. I applied this and made sure it was all rubbed in. Last night, I applied it on before I went to sleep. I waited until it dried. I completely covered my body. And then I went to sleep. And then I woke up in a carrot form. So... Let me show you how it gets blotchy. My whole hand was covered with this lotion, like the top part of my hand, my fingers, and these little thingies right here. And I don't know if you can see, but that is white compared to this color, tan. So I was walking outside with my shirt like this because I didn't want anyone to see this hand. This hand is way worse than the other hand. But... It was so blotchy, and then this turned completely streaky. That's disgusting. And, um, like, it's just so crazy. Right here, I don't know if you can tell, but it's like a huge shade darker. Um, and it was just terrible. The smell is disgusting. I can't even describe it. But it smells so gross. I loaded up perfume on my body and it still stinks like crap. I do not buy this at all. Just please don't buy this. Um, and let me know if you have any self-tanners that work with your skin that isn't so streaky and so blotchy. I don't even know how I'm going to get this off. I was researching all day in class on how I'm going to get it off. And... Um, I heard that if you put lemon on your body, it'll come off, but I think I'm just going to put uh, baby oil on, let it sink in for a while, then take a um, soak in the tub for a while, and then use an exfoliator to try and get it off, because I exfoliated last night before I tanned, and that's how um, I got some color pigmentation, but I didn't think it would get that dark. Um... It's just crazy. Like, I didn't even get the dark shade in this. Um, so, I think I definitely need to find a new tanner. A self-tanner. Like, my fingers look like they've been fried and cooked right now. And it's so streaky. Like, as you can see right here. In between here. And then on this hand, it's like so dark in here. I don't know if you can see that, but it's really dark. It's like a dark rim and then light here and then like tan here and then white here, white around here and then tan inside. It's just crazy. And um, let's see what else it says.
And it says to wash your hands thoroughly after. I washed my hands thoroughly after, okay? And it didn't go away. Like, the back of my hands look like I have a sunburn as well. It's, it's not picking up on camera, but in, like, real life, it's crazy. So, the lotion looks like this. It's like, uh, it's like a really deep, deep bronze with gold shimmers. And that's another thing I hate about this, is that your body will get completely shimmered up. You will look like a walking disco ball. It's disgusting. I do not like it. I don't think anyone should purchase this product. Um, if you like this product, then I don't know how you like it. Maybe you have it in a different shade or you're more fair skin toned and it just works better with your skin. I don't know what the problem is here, but I know that I have to get this off and I need to find myself a new self tanner. Maybe I'll use the gradual tanners to build up color after a couple of weeks because that'll be a little bit better than this. This is an instant bronze glow, but you can build it up. And I don't think I want to go building it up off of what I got here. And my skin is so dry. It claims to have vitamin E inside, but my skin is completely dry. So that is my bashing review on it. I thought I'd share it with you guys to warn you guys that you guys definitely should not purchase this product. This is just a heads up and do not, do not, do not, do not. So yeah, um, let me know what self tanners you like in the bottom comment section and follow me on Twitter and yeah, there will be more videos coming up and I'll see you guys later. Bye guys.